Rivalry weekend on the peninsula, Norfolk State and Hampton, the top two teams in the MEAC. Only one could lay claim to first place after the day. Brian Parsons was there. Now he's here with the game story. Hey, Nathan, it's another edition of the Battle of the Bay hoop style. First place Hampton in, uh, with a half game lead over Norfolk State in the MEAC standing, so plenty at stake on the peninsula. That is how they do it. Packed house at the Convocation Center, and it was a good one. 8,000 plus, by the way. First half off the miss to Sean Taylor with the one-handed putback. You think he's excited? And then it's Jordan Butler, who's going to sky for the two-handed jam. Back and forth in the first half until Hampton went on a run. Quinton Chivas blocked by Butler, but gets his own rebound and gets the strong lay-in. 16 points for Chivas, still in the first. H.U. goes down low to Jervon Presley. The one-handed dunk, and here's how you finish the first half. Reginald Johnson, what a game by him at the buzzer, and he nails the three-pointer, a 23-6 run by Hampton. It led 46-37 at the break second half. Spartans trying to rally. Jeffrey Short, nice move. The lay-in, he wanted a foul right there after the play, but no call, 20 points for Short. NSU did take a brief lead, but the Pirates too much down the stretch. Too much Reginald Johnson gets the steal, and then the layup. 29 points for Johnson. Hampton holds on to first place in the MEAC after defeating Norfolk State 86 to 76 in the Battle of the Bay. Anytime us and Norfolk State is about as big a rivalry as you can get in the country. So anytime that we're able to take care of business and take care of business at home, it's a great thing. Huge confidence boost by the guys going into the second half of the conference. Nothing's changed. We're still in second place. You know, we had a chance, a perfect chance to get in first place and to control our own destiny. But once again, there's eight conference games left. No, no championships and won or lost in January. And we'll be ready to play the next game. There was also an Anita Blanton and Deitra Tate sighting at the game there. Hampton and Norfolk State meet again in the regular season finale on March 3rd in Norfolk. But don't be surprised if they face each other again for a third time in the MEAC tournament, which is at Scope. Nathan.